Obernoz, and I went to North Gates Country last year, and I wasn't from the United States, I was from Texas. The town has an amazing reason to have it. Um, I, can, I can do the projects I want to do, I can have a lifestyle, I can have a family. Texas is the second biggest state for our uh, our great industry in this country. It used to be third. It used to be behind Washington State, where Microsoft and Nintendo are headquartered, and now it's moved up to number two. If we lose incentives, it makes game development in Texas much less appealing. Uh, it has direct impacts on my company, my employees, their families, my family, quite honestly. If you sign away the tax incentive, then you sign away the financial investment in Texas's future. Having that extra bit of money at the end of a project, I mean, maybe the difference between them uh, continuing to conti operate as a company after their product shipped, because anyone in the game industry will tell you that that's sometimes the most volatile time is right after you ship. Unless you have something waiting in the wings, you may have to lay off a whole bunch of people or shut down entirely. This is one little uh, cushion to keep that from happening right away. We didn't have the finance, the big companies would go away, you would have to start to drift away. And the interesting thing about us and Penny is its diversity. You, right here, there are people who make consoles, PC games, old games, I'm an education technology as well. I mean, we're in a wide range of uh, industries, essentially, and even in video game development. And if the fix program goes away, we lose access to that diversity. We should be treated as an industry equal to or better than film. We're that good because we are. And um, that has been a catalyst for significant job creation here over the last four years. And we have a bit of a, 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 an exercise going on down in the capital where we could use your help.